Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Um, today I'm going to be changing out the LCD screen for a Samsung Chromebook. And the tools you're going to need for this job, I um, only need two, which is a 1.5 millimeter screwdriver and a little plastic pry tool. That's the only two things you're going to need. And let's get started. I'm going to turn it off first. Okay, um, first thing you want to do is try to take off this bezel here. Uh, it's very easy, just use your little pry tool. Try to get under it. And then it's going to be secured down into these clips. So you got to go slow so you won't break any of these clips. It's plastic. I kind of got started early so it won't be so hard but you might run into a little resistance just go slowly around the edges so um, it won't break or deform or anything like that okay there it is off comes the bezel on this one it has four screws one two three four and you have to remove those four Use your screwdriver. Okay, and once that's off, just gently lift it up and turn it down it'll be secured by this connector cable here so you want what you want to do is to um, lift up this tab here let me try to bring it up closer yeah this tab kind of lift it up and then slide it off like that okay and just remove it since it's broken you can just throw it away um, I have this extra one that uh, I got from a different Chromebook but you can buy the replacement LCD on uh, eBay or Amazon if they have it just make sure you get the model number right I'll link it in the description below if uh, you need okay and then all you gotta do is reconnect the cable and put the tab down Flip the screen back over, align it, and then let's test it and see how it works, if it works. There you go. No more cracks. Okay. Turn it back off and finish the reinstallation. And this should work for pretty much all of the Samsung Chromebooks. They might be a little bit different variations, but should be very similar. on to the bezel just snap it on plastic clips Be careful not to press on the LCD 
or it will crack for the bottom part right here. I kind of like to give it back support with my other hand behind it. And you know, just go back over it. All the edges. Make sure that it's snapped in nice and neat. And one more time. Just like how it should be. Thank you for dropping by and subscribe if you find this helpful. And I might be doing more videos of repairing laptops and electronics. And give it a like if you find it useful. Thank you for dropping by once again and have a good one guys.